really excited. You know, we got through phase one, through that conditioning piece. It's always just a bunch of hard work in January, February, first part of March, and then we get to spring ball. We finally get to come out here and, and run into each other a little bit. We won't we won't get to as much today because we got to go in helmets, but the guys just lining up and learning, and it's really you know our first spring without that that first class we had. So this will be interesting. I'm excited about being out here and watching these new guys work. It is. It's been it's been kind of that way all through January and February. You know, we had have our team meetings and things like that. You know, the room is just a lot different. But you know, 20 every every time the calendar turns, it's a new year. It's a new you know it's a new football team with a new challenge. And so uh, I really like the guys we have, and I'm excited about uh, the young guys in our program. And we've done a good job. Our, our coaches have done a nice job recruiting and developing guys. So. It's going to be a lot of fun to watch him work today. Well, it's huge. You know, having Hassan back is huge. You know, Hassan played really well through the last seven games. And then, you know, our running backs are back. We're really deep and, and old at wide receivers. So we had a lot of production there. Uh, I think the biggest position we've got to really figure out is our defensive line, lo losing Larry and Tanner and Brandon up front. A lot of plays walked out the door. So that young D line, they got a lot of work to do this spring. And so we'll, we're going to push on those guys pretty hard. Well, Hassan, you know, he's, he's not like a real – vocal loud guy but he's the hardest worker we have so he's leading every day by the way he works um, he shows up every day he works extremely hard he's one of the last guys off the field so i've uh, just really been pleased with Hassan's progress and how he's done and he's got some goals set for himself on what he needs to work on and so it's time now he can come out and start working on those things and we can put him in those situations that he's trying to get better at well, I think our safety position is really strong right now. You look at Ed Roll, you look at uh, Ben DeLuca, you look at A.J. McDonald. A.J. started games around here. you got three guys with a lot of experience. Uh, so, And they're kind of the, the quarterback of our defense. They set everything up from the back end. and So that's been huge. Their work ethic, once again, is extremely, extremely high. And so when you have good players that are hard workers, that, that's good for your football team. And, and those guys have done that through the first couple months here. And looking forward to their progression because both of them were first year players. AJ was a first year player. All of them last year was their first year playing for us and had good years. And, and so uh, we need to you know take the next step with those guys. Well, Coach Atkins, Greg Atkins came to us from Oklahoma State. Uh, he's been coaching the line for a long time, tight ends, whether it's in the NFL or in SEC or Big 12. He brings a lot of O-line experience. So excited about him coming in. Uh, and then Coach Henry's a guy that, that kind of took the, the same philosophy we did with Coach Hood. We brought a defensive guy. He's coached offense before, but we kind of wanted a defensive guy on our offensive staff to present the other side of the story, so to speak. And so he's going to come in and coach our running backs. Coach Gary's easy move going to wide receiver. He played wide receiver for us at Georgia. So that'll be a good transition, easy piece to, to, to transition into. And then, of course, Coach Richardson's coach tight ends. Coach Richardson's been fabulous since day one. He's been here. And, and uh, he's one of the hardest working guys we have on our staff, so he'll do well at tight end. Well, I think, you know, for us, it's, it was good the, the final seven games. Our guys were in every game. We, we won three of them. We were in the other four. Our guys played well down the stretch, and that, that bodes well for us. But as we presented to our team in January, you know, that just shows you how hard you have to work and how much time you got to put in to give yourself an opportunity to be successful. That doesn't mean you will be successful, but it gives you that opportunity. And so I think our guys got a taste of that last year, winning three league games, and are really excited about that. And that's helped us in the off season, but, but uh, that's our focus is you know, next year and, and, and putting ourselves in a position to be successful on Saturdays. Yeah, we're back out here, you know, we're excited and everything. Um, we're gonna get a few kinks out today, but you know, we're just excited to be back out here and playing football back again. Um, we're, we're happy for those guys that came in and started this program up, but they taught us a lot um, about working hard, and we're just going to go out here and show what we got. Uh, in the first few days, you know, we seeing who all fits where. You know, there's a few guys that switch positions, but we're going to see how they play out there, and I know that they'll do really well there, and uh, we're going to focus on the passing game, and we're just going to go out and have fun. Uh, it was a tough, you know, it was a tough loss the last three games, and we were right there at it, and we just... You know, we didn't finish it off. So the big thing, key that we go into the, uh, this year is finishing. And if we can finish, then we'll be able to be successful. Oh, we're looking really good, man. I mean, honestly, we've been working really hard this off season. I mean, we've been putting in the work, putting in the time. You know, team's looking really good. We're coming together. I mean, it's going to be a really exciting year. I'm really excited. Oh, really? We're looking just to make sure we're all lined up in the right spot. This is a tennis outfit, you know. So we're just trying to make sure everybody does everything right, everything's safe, you know. And we're just trying to make sure we see like who competes, who doesn't. It's just kind of something like that. 
Okay, so um, I mean, it's really pushed us because like we know like we're so close. We're all like the very end, very all at the line. But you know, like we've been pushing really hard this off season. We've been saying like, hey, if we want to go to a bowl game next year, like this is what we need to do. And we've been just been pushing and pushing and pushing every day to get better. Big emphasis is just just working hard, man. I mean, everybody has the opportunity to go play wherever they want on defense. I mean, it's just all about who puts in the most effort, who does the most the right things, who studies, who does everything they can to be able to fill a spot like that. I mean, I've just been working with my teammates, man. I mean, it's not like it's not like a single effort. I mean, there's a bunch of leaders on this team, man, and I've just been I've been trying to push wherever I can and help my defense out and help the offense get better every single day and we're just pushing all together, you know.